was born and raised in Miami, Florida, and I started building drag cars over 20 years ago. I moved to Ireland in 2008 and got involved in the drift scene. Over the years, I've been lucky enough to work with some of the biggest names in Ireland. This led me to meet Bagsy in 2018 and travel Europe doing events with the team. So Bagsy approached me to build the GT86 for 2021. My name is Bob Stevens, and this is Motorsport 56. Jimmy. Yeah. Here, come on. You know these seat reels here? Yeah. Can you start getting these seat reels ready to come out and drill all the spot welds and prep the floor? You need to get the sound deadening out because we need to take, start taking the tunnel out. Yeah. I just, just, if you can get this done, we need to get going on this. And then I just yeah. need to do something real quick and then I'll be back, right? Yeah, yeah, no problem. All right. I was Mom, we get some work done. No, I, I, it's about time. Was, you were giving it out to me, it's not getting done. You, you get them seat rails done. Come What's on. You? Jesus Christ. What time do you call this, Jim? Uh, what time do you call this? What are you talking about? It's like fucking six o'clock. Jesus Christ. Me? Seven in the morning. Yeah. I do, yeah. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm here every day at the crack of dawn. As soon as the sun rises, I'm here. So you're only here like 40 No, I, 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 I was, what time did I get here? You got here at about 12 o'clock and then went missing for two hours. And then I came back up, gave out to me because I was doing some work and then got to the back of the car, welded a bit of pipe and now he's complaining he's cut the back of the car off because he can't get in. Because he's not a contortionist, but he did, yet he's, you know, I actually, yeah, I am actually, I'm the the fattest contortionist you'll ever meet. But that's not even a tight spot, man. Oh, it's not a tight spot. It's just awkward. It's actually not bad. It's not as bad as that many. I'll tell you that much. Right. So, what's next? You want to go start cutting the back of the car off, or? Yeah, I need to cut the back of the car off, and then we need to. We have to wait for the subframe to fit the winters, and then to make the floor plate, and then figure out where the radium tank goes, and then. Yeah. get the radiator to mount that. Well, I suppose once we cut the back off, we can kind of see where a yeah. bit more of a direction, but we can open the back of it up to try and see where we need to go with it. Like. Yeah, no, I know. We also need the subframe for the front to fit the engine. So that way we can start doing the, the boost pipes and- Basically, we just need to get onto bags and tell them to get, them some, get us some parts. Yeah, that's basically what needs to happen. You know, that's probably the next thing is when I cut the back off, Take the rails we need to take the rails out and cut the tunnel out and then shoot the tunnel fit the tunnel we'll yeah we're gonna make a custom tunnel for it and um just weld it in the only thing is i have to watch out for the measurements because it can't be too big yeah. so it's going to be a little bit tricky but before we do that the seat rails need to come out all, that seat or no? all right what else are we doing like all you you all you like dinner is something that we need to consider as well. Well, we can't we can't go dinner now what do you mean dinner it's four o'clock, Jim. You only came up 40 minutes ago. What? You, you haven't even done an hour's work yet and you're looking oh, for no, food already. I like how you show up at four <laughs> and you give out to everybody about not working, you lazy <laughs> c 
Uh, well, right now I need to cut the back of the car off. I'd let you cut it, but you're rough, lad. You know how long it took me to fix that parcel shelf back there and make it look nice? But what, what else did you cut off it, You haven't cut anything off. Go look at the back of it and look at all the pieces that are gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you only took them off. Only took them off. I'd like to see you try to take them off. You want to cut the back off? I'll give you 20 quid. I'll buy you a snack box. You're See, it needs to be cut. See this? Hey, you missed a bit, you bollocks. Yeah, I know. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> but when you cut the back off, you get to it. Don't worry about it. It'll be fine. Yeah, see, it needs to be cut across up here. But then what you have to do is, you know, the wheel wheel. You have to, like, cut it like this. And then when you cut across the chassis leg, it'll... I'd like you to do the wheel wheel and then I'll cut the... You want to cut the easy bit? Yeah. Then how are you going to learn if you do the easy bit? You have to do the hard oh, bit. You, it just show me and I'll do the rest. Then. I can mark it out for you. Yeah, I'll explain it to you as well. Yeah, but just try to cut it straight. Open both your eyes, Jim. Get some lights down here. I'm not going to lie. The light is, <laughs> light is bad in here, Jim. So when you come through, it's going to come through here. Yeah. So then you match it. Yeah. And on this in the center, you just come over and across. Yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. yeah. So just try to cut it like tight, like up like this way. You get me? Like tight, yeah. like this. Yeah. And down, and then wherever it comes through here. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So if I were you, what I would do I'll, is... I'll just go from the inside then. Yeah, you need to go from the inside and then like cut across here. Yeah. And then go up and then go through and you'll see on the back side. Yeah. So that way you know where to meet up. You get me? Yeah. So the only thing is when you cut across through the floor here, you cut across, this is fine, but this is a chassis leg. Yeah. So you're gonna have to go under the car again and, and mate it again and yeah. match it. Yeah. Do you understand? And then when the idea is that when it's close to, like I'd probably leave like the top corners or something. Yeah. And we'll leave, we'll snip this and snip that corner and then we can pull, it off, it. pull yeah. it off and sell it on eBay for a thousand quid. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and then build Bagsy for it. Yeah. Yeah. I hope you have a box there. Hey! Oh. Where my glove? There's something holding it. Yeah, you need it. There's something. I don't think you've cut up enough, Jim. I can't get up any higher. Yeah, so you need to cut a window on this. Yeah, put it like you put this one. Yeah, that's what you need to do. No, that's free. Oh, listen. You know what it is, Jim? See, I don't have glow. You see what it is there? Look, Adrian, that's, that's caught right there. You see it, Adrian? You see that there? That's caught. You can't, look, look, see? Try to peel that up. A torch up in there, Edger? Yeah. Oh, underneath, from underneath? Oh, from underneath. Yeah. yeah, that's what it is. There's one little piece there you missed. Is it? Yeah, look at the top. Right. You see it? Is that right? There's fucking... Is there something else? I think something else is what in the fuck, Jim? <laughs> That's pretty cool, actually. It's very light. <laughs> <laughs> flip it on, turn around, and hmm. No going back now. No, but it's like now it's like a whole nother kettle of fish on top of the kettle of fish that we already have. 
Well, anyways, Jimmy, you want to start space framing this and fucking finish this shit? We've made it smaller. Yeah, I know. It's already fucking small. You're obviously going to have to brace that, though. Yeah. Going to have to put, like, a brace across. But the only thing is, again, we don't know where the winters is going to fit. It'd be great if we had a subframe. It would be great. Why don't you call Bagsy there and ask him when we're going to get the fucking subframe? I've got his phone number. You do have his phone number, Jimmy. I have his phone number. You guys are best friends. He doesn't like me anymore. You're his son. Hmm. Well, I don't want to talk to him. I don't want to talk to him. Either. Call Corbin. Ask Corbin to talk to him for us. Anyways, that's good for this week. We got the back cut off. We got the rear stays and boxes in it. Now if we can get the subframe and get the winters in it, figure out what to do with the floor and brace it. And then brace next week. tank position now. Yeah. And then also we need to cut the tunnel out and take the seat rails out next week yeah. so that's good for this week so i'll invoice him and when he pays it we'll do more yeah. <laughs>